Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with uh, construction planning and scheduling in the topic of critical path method. So the problem is there is an activity and uh, procedures then duration. So the activity A there is no procedures and uh, duration is 3. Then activity B the procedure activity is uh, A then duration is 5. Then C activity uh, the procedure is A then duration is 7. So the corresponding activity and then corresponding uh, procedures and corresponding duration also given. Okay. So from that we have to find out the uh, critical path and the critical duration. Then uh, early start time. Then early start time, early finish time. Then latest start time, latest finish time. Also total float. Okay. Now we can draw the network diagram. So first one is A. There is no procedure activity. So we can draw A. So this is activity A. So the duration is 3, there is no precedent activity. Then for B, the activity, uh, B activity, A is a preceder activity. So here we can draw B activity. And also C activity also having uh, A is a preceder activity. So we can draw like this. This is C. For B activity, activity duration is 5. Then C activity, activity duration is 7. Okay. So after that we can draw the D activity. So D activity. So D activity, the procedure is B. So the duration is 10. Okay. So after that, we can draw the C activity, sorry, E activity. The procedure is C. Here we can note, so the D and E activity is the procedure activity of F. Okay. So we can draw like this. Okay. So we can draw E activity like this. So the activity duration is 5. Okay. So after that, we can draw the F activity. The precedent activity is D and E. Okay. So in order to minimize the uh, dummy activity, we can draw like this. So the main rule is CPM is uh, reduce the dummy activity in order to reduce the network path. So that is uh, F activity. So the duration is 4. So now we can uh, write the path. So there is a two path over here. So the first one is A, B, D, F. Okay. So the corresponding duration is 3 plus 5 plus 10 plus 4. Okay. So the total duration is 20. So next path is uh, A, C, E, F. Okay. So the corresponding duration is 3 plus 7 plus 5 plus 4 equal to 19. So now the path is contained the maximum duration is called critical duration and critical path. So this is the critical path. So we can draw like this. Okay. So now we can find out the EST, EFT, LST and LFT. So now we can put plus mark over here. Okay. So now we know this is EST here, EFT here, LST here, LFT. So now we can take uh, here is 0. So then plus 3 direction is 3. So then we can put here 3 over here and also 3 over here. So next thing is 3 plus 5 is 8. Here 3 plus 7 is 10. Next we can put 8 over here. So next uh, 8 plus 10 is 18. Then here 10. 10 plus 5 is 15. So we can take the maximum value from uh, both uh, E, F, T. So here the maximum value is 18. So 18 plus 4 is 22. Okay. So now we can uh, put the 22 over here. So 22 minus 4 is uh, 18. Here we can put 18 and also here we can put 18. 18 minus 10 is 8. Here 18 minus 5 is uh, 13. Here we can put 13 over here. So here we can put 8. 8 minus 5 is 3. Here 13 minus 7. 13 minus 7 is 6. So here we can put the minimum value. So here we can take the 3. So 3 minus 3 is 0. Okay. So this is the uh, EST, EFT, LST, LFT. So we are, now we can put over here EST, EFT, LST and LFT. Okay. So now we can... Uh, write all the activities so here 0 3 0 3 so for b activity 3 8 3 8 so for c activity 3 10 6 13 for d activity 8 18 8 18 so for e activity 10 15 13 18 for f activity 18 22 18 22 so now we can find out the total float so the formula, total float formula is uh, LST minus EST or 
L F T minus E F T. Okay. So now we can take the L S T and E S T values. Here is zero. Here we can take uh, three minus three is zero. So here six minus three is three. Then here eight minus eight is zero. Then uh, thirteen minus ten is three. Then eighteen minus eighteen is zero. Okay. So these are all the total float of the activities. Okay. So this is the method we can solve the problem. Again, we will see next video. Thank you.